The Labour Party governorship candidate for Imo, Ethan Achonu, and scores of his supporters on Thursday stormed the national headquarters of the Independent National Electoral Commission in Abuja to demand the true certified copy of the just-concluded poll in the state. Achonu, who was accompanied by the national youth leader Kennedy Ahanotu, also accused the electoral umpire of playing a double standard in the November 11 off-cycle election. The protest came two weeks after INEC declared Governor Hope Uzodima of the All Progressives Congress winner of the election. The APC candidate polled 540,308 votes to beat Samuel Anyang of the People's Democratic Party, who scored 71,503 votes, and Achonu, who could only secure 64,081 votes. Our state commission agent duly asked INEC to not to announce any result that collation started very early that day even while voting was going in uploading uploading to the portal to the IRF start, started while even voting was taking place was still ongoing so how did that happen that they should go to their back end server and confirm the results they were about to announce that they are not correct so I refused to do that that uh, uh, returning officer insisted because you could see that he, he had an agenda. So we duly wrote to INEC asking them to review that election that they're not supposed to announce. They hurriedly announced that election even before the seven days that we allowed for review had passed. So INEC now, we wrote on Monday, we asked them, give us access to the same results that you claim that we lost, that you declared. Up to today, as we, are, we speak here, we have not received a permission to collect the citizens of that, of that uh, election. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.